Hello everyone. Today we're going to look at the hydroponic garden after just one month. It is amazing, amazing, amazing. Look at these, um, uh, the growth. It, first of all, that's what hit me every day that I've come out to water, that I've come out to see how everything is going. I have noticed growth every day. In order to keep the, um, the plants going, I water twice a day and I'm going to up that now to three times a day. And it literally takes one minute three times a day uh, to, to water. And you can see the reservoir here. I plug in the reservoir and it comes through it comes through to these little tubes to water everything that is extra all of the water that's extra it um, it drains back out into the tub so every time i change the water which is about once a month or once a week um, i take out all of the water in the reservoir and and refill it and then I check the pH and I condition it if it's too high the pH is too high then I use a certain um, uh, remedy and too low I use a certain remedy to bring it up this compared to a regular garden outside I don't have to weed I don't have to uh, water a great deal, so I'm, I'm, you know, the the water is being reused. I maybe use uh, four gallons of water in a in a um, in a week, and whatever is drained when I change the water, I go water the tree outside. So nothing really is is being wasted. What I'm excited about literally is the turnover, the, the ability to grow food very quickly and, and safely and um, uh, organically. If you can see this tiny little, this tiny little um, cucumber, that's in a month. This is lettuce, and I'm thinking that I may have to harvest because it's a, you know, it's pretty thick. So that will give me a um, a good type of thing. You can see that the, um, you know, the the core, the center of the lettuce is starting. So, but it's very good. I'm going to take a little taste. Mmm. Yep little balsamic vinaigrette on that. <laughs> and I'm waiting for my cucumber. Maybe I'll wait for my cucumber to be ready at the same time. We had zero degree temperatures here. And in this, I've, I've used a little heater over there to keep, um, to keep it a little bit warmer. And the lights do help uh, keep it warm. But through all of this, this has happened in zero degree weather. And I absolutely would love to see children learning how to grow their own vegetables in school. Can you imagine having year round fresh vegetables for these children and they're doing it all themselves very easily, you know? They say children and, and older people, you know, we're, we're challenged a little bit, but look at this. <laughs> we're doing it. <laughs> Thank you. Bye-bye.